Today we're heading to the state championship in St. Cloud, Minnesota, and we're super excited. Here we go. This morning at IJ Holton, we are excited to announce and have a kickoff for state for the robotics team. Our IJ Holton students, the sixth graders, are going to state and we gave them a pep rally to get them ready and prepared and to encourage them to do their best at the state competition. You can be amazing, you can turn a phrase into a weapon or a drug. like this in the display case, but your classmates here at Holton have been working really hard to make two incredible robots that they've been competing with at different competitions. We've competed in Albert Lee, and we've competed in Osseo, and today, as soon as we're done here, we're gonna be traveling to St. Cloud. How many of you know where St. Cloud is? Okay, it's kind of far away, right? We get to go to St. Cloud to participate in the state championship, which is absolutely awesome. Our sixth graders are in a unique situation and they are very competitive in the sense that they did well as sixth graders, but they are competing against high school students and our students are competing at a very high level and have done a really nice job thus far. At our last competition, these two teams tied for fourth place, which is absolutely great. We compete against high school teams. They're not competing against other sixth graders. They're competing against high schoolers. Maybe you guys saw some of the pictures of all the kids that were a lot taller than our, than our teams. Okay, Those are all high schoolers. We actually compete against two college freshman teams. How cool is that? Our sixth graders are doing an amazing job. They're The uh, students have been working all year long on the uh, uh, VEX Robotics platform. They've been able to engineer their own designs. Well, there's a claw in the robot that can pick up blocks and sky rises to complete different tasks. And then there's a, it's called a simple drivetrain lift that goes, the one that goes up and down like this. And then the one that's moving up and down right now, which is called a rack and pinion, helps us get a little more height advantage. And then the wheels are, uh, they're called mechanism wheels. It helps reduce friction when you're turning because it doesn't have treads. To meet certain needs, they've been programming um, in various different coatings. And uh, it's been really cool to see the different things that they're able to make those robots do. We have a scissor lift and a rack and pinion to we have our cloud, we put uh, rubber bands on our cloud because it grabs sky risers better. The sky risers are four points in the game. It increases the grade. <laughs> <laughs> We have amazing instructors and Ms. Jensen in teaching and developing these skills to students that have not had the opportunity until they reach IJ Holden so that they have these experiences and opportunities to determine if this is something that they would like to continue and pursue. Today when we go compete in St. Cloud, we're competing today and we're competing tomorrow. We are competing for the, the opportunity to win either a U.S. Open award to be traveled to the U.S. Open competition. We're also competing for a World Championship competition award. So that's really awesome. Both of those are not in Minnesota. So we'll see what happens. But either way, it's absolutely amazing that these kids have made it to state. So I'd like to introduce you to both of the teams. This is I.J. Holton Engineers 8440A. We have an A and a B. 
And we have we have Jackson, Carson, Riley, Corey's hiding in the back. Andres, Morgan, Maria, and Katie. Give them a hand. pretty interesting to watch the kids grow um, in their confidence levels and their experience with robotics this year. They've uh, been able to work with high school level teams and compete at their levels and so it's been pretty amazing as far as what they've been able to do this year and be at the state robotics competition this week. Our sixth grade students along with our fifth graders as well they use and have the robotics course that is a required course here so that students are developing and enhancing their mathematics, science, and engineering skills so that they can develop those skills in order to take other courses along the road of 7th and 8th grade and into the high school. We have something they try to get me with these robots every day. I'm just trying to spread the love. Um, so we have something called the parade of teams that they're going to be participating in um, up at the tournament and they just have to show off their school spirit and their team spirit and their excitement to be at the championship. So we have a little something that um, we have a couple people who'd like to send you off with a little bit of um, I guess advice and they have some they have something special for you, okay? Championship in St. Cloud, Minnesota, and we're super excited. Here we go! 